this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video, and another video inside of Stampy's lovely world. And today in this video, I am going to be joined, by the looks of it, by Esther the Chicken, and oh, Esther just laid an egg this very second, which is very good timing because I needed an egg for my excellent egg throwing game. And I am also going to be joined by... Lee Bear! Good morning, Lee Bear! And I'm also being joined by Lee Bear's new dog. Uh, if you saw my last video, there was a, a wild dog that we uh, managed to tame, or well, Lee managed to tame. And uh, if you remember, the dog loved the love garden. And so Lee has decided to call his dog Larry Love. So everybody, you can now meet Larry Love. How are you doing today, Larry? <laughs> Look at that! Look how stone-faced he is. He's there looking at Lee going, what is this weird cat talking about? <laughs> oh dear. Anyway, Lee, it's time for the favourite part of the video. You know what? I think I only make these videos just so I can have my cake. I might as well just eat the cake and then go back to bed because that's all I care about. Everything else is just filler until I'm able to have another cake. And don't you have one, Lee? Is he having to look into my chest to find a cake? Are there any cakes in there? Do you not have any cakes, Lee? I'm not going to have to go a day without my breakfast. An apple? An apple? This isn't this isn't cake. This isn't tasty and delightful and covered in frosting and icing. Oh, there we go. You get an apple cake. There we go. There's compromise. There's part of a balanced meal. I'm having an an apple cake. <laughs> Maybe those are what those little red bits are. I thought they were cherries. Maybe they're little pieces of apple. Anyway, I am very hungry, so num 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 num. There we go. I might as well eat the cake and then to be good, I'm going to eat an apple as well. <laughs> anyway, do you do you have an egg on you, Lee? Are you, are you holding an egg? Uh, I've got one, and there we go, Lee's got an egg there as well. So let's go on the balcony, and let's play the egg throwing game. And if you've not seen this, it couldn't be any simpler. We've got to throw an egg, and uh, try and hit one of these paintings that are scattered uh, all over the area. And so far, Lee hasn't done too great. He's not actually managed to hit one yet. He does normally go for the difficult ones, though, so I guess this is his, his chance to redeem himself. There's no point showing off, Lee. Why are you trying to throw the egg with your head facing the wrong direction? What was that? <laughs> A bit of a feeble attempt, I'll be honest, Lee. Were you going for the one over by the theatre? Right, let me give it a go. I'm not going to spin in a circle like a mad bear. I'm going to aim it up about there and throw and... No, no, Cell. The ones far away are really difficult. We're going to get them. Eventually, we are going to get them all. Do you have any more eggs for us, Esther? Are you going to allow us to have one more go? Nope, she's been a stubborn chicken. I guess we can <laughs> come back in the, the next video and have a, another attempt. And oh, we're both trying to get through the door at the same time. That isn't good. Oh yeah, by the way, uh, my ender chest down here, which I made in the, the last video, I have filled up with jewels. It's filled up with diamond and gold and all sorts of glorious stuff. Yeah, this is basically all of my diamonds. And I had about 40 of them. I was pretty rich. And uh, also some gold as well I've put in here just to make it all look fancy. And I love it. I just love looking in there and seeing all of my riches. <laughs> Actually, I should probably make a, um, a diamond pickaxe because this one's almost destroyed let me just take three of these diamonds i'm going to take them from here so i don't ruin the pattern and i could actually make an enchant a diamond pickaxe that would be cool wouldn't it all right let me go and do that before we head over to the love garden and then i'm going to explain exactly uh, what it is we're going to be building in today's video so uh, why am i going up here this is the wrong way let's go back down here to the crafting tables let's go to the crafting room and uh, go and make myself a, a brand new diamond pickaxe it's been a while since i've had a diamond pickaxe and uh, i do love them and oh, i can't make any oh i need sticks there we go. I've got enough diamonds, but not, not enough sticks. <laughs> it's normally the other way around. So here we go. A nice brand new shiny diamond pickaxe. And let's enchant it to make it even better. As uh, soon as I am level 25, which is uh, very good for me. So let's go and head through my secret painting. And uh, let's put it in and let's try and get lucky and get a good enchantment. Let's put it in a few times. Hopefully get it lucky, get a high enchantment. Uh, there we go, 23. That will do. And I got, wow, look at that. Efficiency, unbreaking and fortune. That will do me lovely. And uh, I'm going to put the, the old pickaxe, uh, pickaxe in here. <laughs> this is the discarded items, an old book and an iron pickaxe that is almost broken. I'm just going to leave that in there for now. And let's go over. Oh, easy now. There's a, there's a creeper on my roof up there. I don't think he can see me. Hi, Creeper. Hi, Creeper. Look at him there just gazing off into the distance. Oh, be careful, Lee. Be careful, Lee. He's coming your way. He's on the roof near the love garden. I'm going to go deal with him. 
Right, I want to be careful that he's not going to jump on my head if I just charge out. He hasn't seen me, has he? Oh, he's right up there. Oh, now he has seen me. He has seen me. This is dangerous. He doesn't want to drop down, though. Oh, God, no, he's running away. Can I get him? Ah, oh, no, he just managed to, to back off. Right, you've got to watch my back, Lee. I'm going to go and add someone to the love garden. You've got to watch my back and make sure that the, the creeper doesn't dive down on me. Anyway... Uh, today to the Love Garden, uh, I'm adding Lexi, and that is because Lexi uh, has an amazing Stampy Cat model, and you can see it on your screen now. It is massive, a huge model uh, Stampy Cat, and I don't know who made it. Uh, she doesn't actually say in the video, uh, but I thought it was fantastic. And she also made another video uh, where she was uh, suggesting uh, some ideas for things that I could build in my fun land. And she said about building another roller coaster and uh, a water slide. And uh, yeah, she seemed like a really nice person. Uh, so I wanted to say thank you very much and welcome to my love garden and good job, Lee. There's another one down there. There are googlies all over the place. And frankly, I don't appreciate it. There we go. Managed to <laughs> take out all of the, the creepers. And anyway, let's go and let's go and start building then, shall we? Uh, today we are building building a hospital and uh, we're going to be building that over next to the pretty kitty spa and uh, I'm going to of course grab a dog before we start doing that and the plan is to get the entire outside of the hospital built in just today's video that is going to be our plan and we're going to be building uh, with the blocks we gathered in the last video uh, all of the the never quart blocks and who shall I take with me today let's take with me spring I think I'm going to take with me today and let me go and try and find spring can you see spring anywhere around here we go. Here is Spring. Spring's the uh, the dog with the longer legs. And uh, if you're not like me and uh, can't tell them apart, uh, you can see that it, uh, Spring's got the the lime green collar. That's the that's the way the rest of you can tell which one's Spring. But me spending so much time with my dogs, I can tell them apart anyway. No, honestly, honestly, I can. <laughs> anyway, let's go and head over here. And hello, Larry. Nice, nice, nice for you to join the crew. Hopefully, Spring and Larry. Uh, are gonna get on uh, on by their uh, yeah they're, they're gonna get on fine and become friends because Larry uh, normally likes to, to spend time by himself he's normally not very sociable uh, Larry's normally a bit of a lonesome so <laughs> hopefully they are gonna get on with each other anyway this big massive space here is where we're gonna be building the hospital and it's not gonna be that big we're not gonna take up the entire space but uh, yeah we're basically gonna build it right here next to the the pretty kitty and it's gonna be pretty big though actually and so let me find a good place to build it so I want to build it a little bit in uh, uh, maybe I'll do the, the front of it uh, about here, I reckon. And I'm going to leave a, a little bit of a gap between here. But I think, yeah, if I have the wall along here, this should be about perfect. And it's going to be 20 blocks along and 13 back. So if I go uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And then I need to go 20 along here. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, ooh, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. That should be perfect. And then uh, about halfway along there, we're going to have the, the front door, the entrance. And so I just need to go and build along here and uh, allow it to all link up. And uh, what am I doing? What? What a mess. Luckily, I've got this brand new pickaxe. Look how quickly it destroys these blocks. That is fantastic. <laughs> right. So if I just go and build uh, along here. Uh, then this should all link up. And this is going to be my hospital. So yeah, it's not going to be massive and it is only going to be one floor. But there's going to be four different rooms inside uh, which are all going to cure different things. And I'm going to explain all about that a little bit later on in the video. But first, uh, let's go and try and get this building done. And look, look at Lee go. He is not wasting any time. You know what I might do? I might just set up a little seat down here and just watch Lee go because he is working way faster than I could. Only jokingly, I'm going to help out. But first, I'm going to have another tasty apple and there we go. Lee missed two blocks. That's my contribution. All right, let's get this doorway done then because it's going to be a little bit uh, weird. And did you hear that? I think I heard a googly just go land down here in googly goods. I think I heard that. Was that a zombie? Oh, it's a skeleton. Hello, skeleton. How are you doing today? Are you enjoying your time in the cage? <laughs> I guess this is what you get. Oh, did you hear that? I heard an egg getting laid as well. It's all going on in here. What an exciting place. There we go. I got another egg. Anyway, I need to work. I need to work. Why, why can't I work? I just can't focus on building today. I'm getting more distracted than usual. Anyway, let's get this door done. So I want to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So this should be uh, the middle along uh, because 10 is half than 20. There we go. That looks like that's directly in the middle. And I got a few more uh, never quartz on me here. And uh, so let's go and build the, the front here then, shall we? So I'm going to do like a little archway, kind of a bit like a balcony. And I'm actually going to do the floor uh, using chiseled... Um, 
Uh, yeah, using chisel never quartz. I really just made a crafting table and I already had one. There we go. We can surround the chest in crafting tables. And uh, in here, these are all of the, the quartz slabs that I made uh, when I used, you know, that weird glitch I spoke about in the last video, if you remember that. And so I can use some of these to try and make some chiseled never quartz. So uh, let me go and try and find it there. I need some pillars of never quartz I'm going to use and some chiseled one as well. Because what we're going to do uh, in all of the, the corners... Uh, here we're going to use the the pillars and build up like this just so it makes like a quite a funky pattern and then on the floor down here we're going to use the the chiseled ones and I think these are the chiseled ones here and I think I need to make a, a few more of them yeah I've only got six of those so if I go and make some more chiseled never quartz uh, and then I can use that uh, to do the the floor down here at the the front so let me just go and uh, break a, a few blocks around here and oh, I need to be careful I forgot there's a big hole there and so I think uh, about this will be fine and if I go to like this, then I'm going to have a few pillars of never quartz here to like hold up the entrance. And then there's going to be a big red cross, which is kind of the uh, the international sign for, for hospitals. So that's going to be, uh, of course, there at the front. So let me put down uh, a few torches uh, just so I can see what it is I'm doing. And uh, let's go build in this floor. And I, j I just wanted to use all of the, the different types of never quartz. And pretty much the entire hospital is going to be made out of this stuff. It's all going to be uh, this sort of white colour. So, uh, yeah, you better you better get used to it. If you don't like this block, then you're probably not going to like the hospital. Actually, we're going to have um, some carpets on the inside, which are going to be red, just to add that that small splash of colour. But apart from that, uh, apart from that, it is all going to be never quartz. So let's go and build this along here. And then we're going to use pillars uh, to build up here. And I think I'm going to go five high. So one, uh, two three four five so yeah there we go that should be about the the same height as that i believe and then i want to use just normal never quartz uh, to build along like this and then this is where the the big red cross is going to be so if i just go and build uh, all of this up along here and then I need to add uh, another pillar on the front there. And then this is where I'm going to be building the, the big red cross. And then I'm actually going to use a red carpet uh, to go all the way the, uh, around the outside at the, the top up here. Uh, just to add that other little splash of colour just to make it uh, not just look like a complete big white block. And this looks cool! I kind of like the look of this already. So let me go and I don't know why I jumped down there. I might as well have uh, stayed hopped up. And let's go and try and build the, the big red cross then, shall we? It's probably the simplest thing to, to build in the world. So uh, even I... I'm going to be able to do it and uh, if any of you wanted to try and build a, a hospital as well uh, then all of you would be able to, to do it as well and uh, actually I think I might build I might build in a bit lower here just so I've got more room to fit it all in and we do want to be careful by the way I'm going to have to require your protection Lee because it is becoming night and you know how oblivious I get <laughs> we're going to have to be on a on strict googly watch together uh, hopefully we won't get snuck up on so uh, I've placed that down there and I've got quite a lot of red wool on me here so I'll do my cross which will be like that and then if I hop back up to the top, uh, I'll be able to do another one up here somewhere, I guess. If I go and place that down there. Just like that. There we go. Here's going to be my red cross at the front. And so I might go around now and start adding in all of the, the carpets. And here we go. I've already uh, spotted my, my first googly. Let's go and try and take out the spider. What a shot. Down in one. I love my bow. It's so, so good. And I should probably have something to eat as well. I am getting a, a little bit peckish. And so, yeah, I'm going to make a whole load of red carpets. And uh, to make uh, carpets, all you need is a red wall. I can't remember where it is. Is it in decorations? Yeah, here we go. And so to make some red carpets, I've got all my red wall on me. And I want to make loads of these because they're going to go the, the whole way around the outside and I also want to make some quartz stairs as well and because these are going to go around the outside as well but oh no it looks like I've already run out of never quartz I think if I make some some more how do I make never quartz again are they round here Oh no, I, I can't make any more. Okay, oh, I, from the half slabs, I can't make them. But if I put down two together, does that make a full block? Does it, if I break this, oh no, they, okay, they still count as them. Okay, I, I need to make some stairs, but I'm going to have to go back to the never, I think, to get some more. Unless you have any more on you, Lee. If you have any more never quartz blocks, if you throw them to me, uh, then that would be very handy. Anyway, let's go and get some of these, these curtains going. I'm up here. You're going to have to do a big throw, Lee. Sorry to get it up to me. <laughs> right, and I'm not going to waste any time. I'm going to keep building. Lee's there going to be trying to catch me up to try and throw me the blocks as I'm <laughs> going around putting the carpets all over the place. Yeah, so these are going to go all around the outside, and then uh, it's going to be raised one more in the middle uh, with some stairs and we're going to fill it all in so it's going to be slightly multi-layered so there's going to be uh, absolutely massive ceilings uh, inside of the the hospital and so this is going to go around like this and then I think it will go oh there we go oh thank you absolutely perfect loads of the stuff so uh, this is all oh, skeleton skeleton Lee help googly there we go I just see him on fire flying out look at Lee go <laughs> he has zero fear of any of these googlies I absolutely love it and uh, I think I heard some more falling down into the um 
into the, the googly goods place in the, the pick a pet pet shop as well. Let's see how many we can collect by the end of the video. Let's go have another look and see what we've got inside of here. Oh, here we go. We've got one skeleton and one zombie in here now. I'm going to have another look a little bit later on just to see if our, our collection will grow at all. And here we go. Look, it already almost looks a bit like a hospital. I'm kind of proud of what we've done so far. And by we, I mean mainly Lee. I've done a very small amount of it. Anyway, let's see how many stairs we can make. I'm not sure how many he threw me. There we go. I got 52 stairs. And I think that might be uh, all of the the nether quartz we have. So I am going to have to go uh, again back to, to the nether. <laughs> I said never again, but I guess I'm going to have to go back. <laughs> and so, yeah, we're going to have to get some more at some point. Unless you do have any more on you, Lee, I, I will need quite a lot because we're going to have to do stairs the uh, the whole way around the outside here. And then I can actually just use the, the half slabs to fill in the middle. And I think he threw some more to me. There we go. He did actually manage to throw some more to me. He managed to, to mine a lot more than me in the last video. Than, uh, yeah, he mined a lot more than I realised. So if we go around like this... This bit can be kind of poking up a bit like this. And then all I need to do is go around the, the whole inside with these stairs. And it, it, it's kind of awkward placing stairs when you're kind of not placing them on anything. You've got to just place them uh, on the, the side of the, the other stairs. So it's a little bit awkward. And while I'm doing that, you can see Lee there going crazy trying to, to destroy all of the ground. Uh, I'm not sure what the, the floor is going to be like there, Lee. I think we're going to have red carpet for like a corridor uh, going exactly down the middle. So three blocks wide. See kind of where that grass is? If you do it from, yeah, from there to the other side in red wool, uh, that's going to be how it's going to be. I've got some red wool on me now if you want me to throw some to you. Do you want me to throw you some so you can catch it? Right, I'm going to try and throw it onto your little block that you're floating on there. You ready? you got to catch it. All right, it's going to take ages if I do it like this, right? Blah 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 of me and then yeah this should be there there you go I've got 45 left this should be uh, more than enough to finish this off I want to do this I want to actually complete this. I want to fully do the outside of the hospital in one video. Look at us. See, when, when we do eventually focus and stop getting distracted by everything, we can actually make some quite good progress. The problem is, there often isn't much time when, um, <laughs> when I am focused on what I'm doing and not being distracted by everything else that, that's around me. Do you do that as well? You know when there's something important that you need to do? Do you just go and find a million like distractions so you don't need to do it? And hello... Hello, Gregory Jr. You made a long trip over here, didn't you? Be careful in the water. No, 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 don't go in the water, Gregory Jr. No, do you want to go in the pretty kitty spa, do you? Do you want to be beautified? Is that what's going on? You're already beautiful, Gregory Jr. Okay, you can go in if you want. Do you not want to go in? Are you, or are you just having a, a look around the place? I don't know if he's seen the uh, the pretty uh, kitty spa finish yet. Did you want to go inside? Oh, he wants to go in the jacuzzi. I see. Come on then, Gregory Jr. We can go in the jacuzzi. You, come on, can, can you swim at all? Do the doggy paddle? <laughs> there we go. You can see. Oh, sorry. I just put a. <laughs> I look like I put a massive hat on his head there. Look at look at his new hat. You look lovely. You can sit down there in the jacuzzi if you want, Gregory Jr. He's come all the way over from the Funland. That's uh, quite a quite a trip he's done. Anyway, let's go hop up here and actually try and get this finished, then, shall we? Because I do still uh, need to fill in the the whole top of the roof where this uh, where this raised bit is. And uh, I'm going to go and read your sign in one second, Lee. I did notice that you're writing that. And so yeah, I just want to carry on doing these stairs. And then I think the the last big thing that we need to do is uh, go and fill in the the top raised bit. And I'm doing ru I'm doing rubbish at building today. I'm building very slowly. I keep placing blocks in the wrong place and all sorts. I don't know I don't know what's going on. I think it was that apple. I think eating fruit was a shock to my system and my body couldn't handle it. And now <laughs> my body's rejecting or something. Anyway, let's go see what Lee's sign down here said. Uh, I'm gonna jump on this dirt tower so I can get rid of this on my way down. And Lee said, "Where the red go?" <laughs> Where the red go indeed, Lee. So basically just one straight clear from here, yeah, to the wall directly ahead of you, but three blocks wide. And then there's going to be stairs on either side, uh, not stairs, sorry, uh, doors on either side uh, leading to, to all of the, the different rooms. And let's see what our collection of googlies has got to. Ah, oh, we still only got uh, two of them. I wanted to hopefully have another one. Uh, so yeah, all I need to do is go up top and uh, start finishing off the... Um, 
uh, yeah, the, the, the middle bit, and then the whole thing should be almost completely done. And I did mention that I was going to tell you what's going to be inside, and I've not done that yet. So, uh, yeah, there's going to be three different rooms. One room uh, is going to be for zombies, uh, because now you can get uh, zombie villagers, and you can actually cure them. And so it's going to be a zombie curing room, and it's going to be called the Not All Bad Zombie Lab. <laughs> Basically saying that zombies aren't all bad, you can cure them. And yeah, you need to throw a weakness potion at them, and then give them a golden apple. And uh, I'm actually going to do a, um, uh, make a, a machine. Oh, look, I can actually just only do half slabs. That's cool. I can have the ceilings even higher. Yeah, so I'm going to, yeah, basically do a machine that's going to do that to, to cure zombies. And then also I'm going to have a burn clinic room. If you remember in my last episode, I went to the nether and yeah, I got set on fire by a blaze way more than I would like. <laughs> and so I'm going to do a room and fill it full of water and ice. Uh, so it's going to be a place to, to cool you down. It's going to be called uh, the feeling nice healing ice or something along those lines <laughs> and so you can go in there to, to cool down if you're feeling a little bit toasty and then I'm also going to do a room where I'm going to make all of the medicine and that's going to be called the feeling fab med lab I think I'm going to call that one this is all subject to change but these are my <laughs> my ideas for now and the final one is going to be where there's going to be a therapist there's going to be uh, some sort of psychologist or therapist uh, who's going to be in there and so if you're feeling a bit down or unhappy you can go in there and have a little chat about your life and hopefully he's going to make you feel better and uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to call that one I think I might call that one uh, can't be missed therapist or, or something along those lines I'm going to have a chaise lounge, lounge in there and <laughs> do it so you can go and have a lie down and speak to the shrink and hopefully uh, he's going to make you uh, feel all better so it's not just uh, uh, repairing your body it's also going to be repairing your mind in this hospital so uh, yeah they're what the uh, the four rooms are, are going to be and that's what we're going to be uh, building uh, in the next video but we've so nearly done it do you want to hop up here Lee and help me just finish in these uh, last few bits and then we would have completely finished building the the entire outside in this one video i kind of like doing out of half slabs as well because it does mean that we can have uh, the the ceilings even higher than they would have been and <laughs> lee's there using a, an elegant way to to get to the top uh, if i throw down there's a whole load of half slabs for you up here lee uh, once you do manage to get up if you did want to go up the normal way, there's a little dirt staircase there if you didn't want to be uh, so elegant using the ender poles. We've almost done it though. We've almost uh, completely uh, done the, the entire outside of the hospital. And I need to, to properly decide what it's going to be called. I'm thinking of calling it uh, the Caring Cat Clinic or something along those lines. I think that would be quite fitting considering the fact I am a cat. And oh look, I'm still wearing all of my iron armor. I'm still feeling very protected right now. So uh, I guess that's quite good. And here we go, the, the last few blocks and we are done. The hospital has been completely built on the outside in just one video by me and Lee. And here it is. This is this is what it looks like. I think it looks great actually. I think this does uh, look just like a, a real hospital apart from the random pile of dirt we have on the side, but I can quickly get rid of that. <laughs> so in the next video, uh, we're going to go inside and build all of the, the other rooms that I mentioned about. And just before the end of the video, I'm going to go in here and see what my googly collection is like. Here we go. My collection is growing. I've got a triplet of zombies <laughs> and the original skeleton still down there as well. I'm well stocked up in my in my uh, with my googlies in my ghastly ghouls and googly good section in my pick a pet pet shop. <laughs> anyway. That's the end of this video here. Hopefully you all enjoyed watching it as much as I enjoyed making it. A big thank you to Elfa Lee for helping me build the hospital. And as always, a big thank you to you uh, for watching the video. And I will see you all later. Bye!